Hockey great Ken Dryden once said, there are a lot of very good goalies. There are even a fair number of great goalies, but there aren't many important goalies. And Jacques Plante was an important goalie. Closes in, takes his shot. Hi, I'm Rebecca Brayton and welcome to WatchMojo.com and today we'll be learning more about the man who changed the face of hockey. Now tell us more about the incident of the mask that incited him wearing the mask. He'd always worn a mask in practice a couple of years preceding that. Uh, ironically, um, he had suffered a lot of his injuries in practice, clip pucks, he'd broken cheekbone one year, the other cheekbone the next year. He tried a lot of masks, experimented, he was never really comfortable until he received one in the fall of 1959 called the Birchmore mask. He wanted to play with that mask and he went to Clarence Campbell, the president of the NHL, who gave him permission to wear that mask. Toe Blake, however, was not fond of it. Toe Blake refused to let him wear the mask in a game until that night in New York when he took the shot from Andy Bathgate and the puck to the face. He was such a mess that he told Toe Blake that I can go in but I have to wear the mask. And Toe really didn't have a choice. In those days, they didn't carry backup goalies like they do today. Toe probably regarded it as a temporary thing, and Plant kept on winning with the mask. He was the subject of ridicule for it, and surprisingly enough, a lot of his fellow goalies weren't fond of it either. It had to be somebody like Plant, who was oblivious to what other people thought of him, was comfortable in his own position, and held a pretty high status in the game at the time, to be able to have the courage and the fortitude to wear the mask. How did this decision change hockey? Him putting on the mask started an era where we thought more of protection. By the time he retired from Edmonton 15 years later, everybody in the NHL was wearing a mask. Face it, how many people are gonna have the courage to skate out with Bobby Hall coming down, winding up with a 100 mile an hour slap shot and to stare at him with your face open? It seems funny that now in an NHL game, if the goalie's mask comes off, the whistle automatically goes and the play is stopped. So it's really gone a 360 compared to what it was back then. Thank you very much. Thank you.